Hello everyone, I am Gabriel and welcome to my channel. I am playing Carnotaurus, although I am not big, I'm not a big one. My um, growth stage is 81%. I am an adult, a fresh adult with 115 points of damage with my bite. It's a free uh, damage output bite in itself for uh, all playables and a weight of 1250 which is kind of alright which is kind of alright now in a one versus one fight with uh, Uteraptor with Uteraptor um, you always win uh, above all if you are in this mod pool alright that that one is raising its head I'm gonna raise my head as well oh, check it check it how posh how posh Carnage can look when raising head uh, I don't know kind of cool so um, if you are playing Carnotaurus and you are here at mod pool the chances you win are 100% against even a huge Uteraptor pack I mean unless they start biting all at once you your Carno then uh, uh, they might actually take you down but it's only by bite force because mod pools do not allow uh, any playable to use uh, their uh, special ability you can only move not even run move and bite move and bite this is uh, uh, why carnotaurus is actually super strong around mob pools even against uh, stegosaurus if a stegosaurus gets in here they can only move and bite they cannot use tail whip so you are around mob pool around um, any mod pool you know there is a mod pool over there well that's uh that's a lifesaver for your carnotaurus because you have the strongest bite force and uh your uh, and other special abilities cannot be used no special ability can be used no pounds no headbutt no tail slam no tail whip uh, not charge but uh, who cares because your bite force is 175 points of damage most mud pools anyway they are farther away from water so uh, it's a uh, it's gonna be a super rare occasion uh, if you see a uh, denosuchus in uh, in a mud pool super rare because uh, probably it's the only one check i am actually afraid of uh, those uh, um, carnotaurus over there you never trust a group you never trust a group uh, like that there is a uteraptor that might have been the same one that was friendly to my carno or it might be another uteraptor in this case scenario you want to play safe and hide and uh, put as much distance as possible between you and uh, those carnotaurus are they writing in chat they are not even writing in chat so if you happen to see a situation like this be careful because uh, a skirmish is about to happen and you are not gonna like it you're gonna say oh I got taken down by two Carnos and one Uteraptor that was unfair mix parkers no you had plenty of chances to move away that's why I'm moving away that's why I'm moving away above all if you're playing solo if you're playing solo any group that is using um, different types of uh, playables are very strong um, Carnies with Carnies Carnies with herbies, herbies with other types of herbies, herbies with other type of carnies. Uh, they are actually very strong. You can only do one thing: sight them on time, see them on time, and move away. You move away. You do not want to stick in that area. You want to move or hide. I am hiding in this case. Uh, those two carnos, if they are adult, they can actually uh, take me down even in the mud pool because it's two versus one. Same thing goes when there is two stegos against one stego. Unless you see uh, what's go you've managed to foresee what might happen in a uh, very short uh, in a very short window in future, you uh, better leave. You better leave. You better leave. That's why uh, I'm going back here. I, I thought I was about to fight a couple of Utahs. But instead, it turned out to be uh, me running away from possible danger. Because I do not want to lose my uh, Carnotaurus yet. By the way, stay around this area, mod pool. This huge trash pit in uh, vulnona.com. This will read as trash pit. It's uh, plenty of trash in a huge mod pool. Uh, so stay stick around this area as a Carnotaurus. But beware of other Carnotauruses. Beware of them. Uh, you are super safe to fight against uh, a lot of other playables but of course you have to uh, keep a special eye open against other Carnos because uh, Carnotaurus is cannibal above all so you get that S-shaped nutrient out of it 
you manage to get that as shape nutrient out of uh, out of uh, another Carnotaurus meat. I mean, come on. Here, S shape, S shape. So it means other Carnos have actually the good excuse not to be friendly. Same thing goes with Denosuchus. So avoid, avoid these kind of situations. Avoid these kind of situations. Avoid them. Well, uh, that's all for today. This is uh, uh, me playing around mod pool until I am fully grown. I just uh, uh, check my surroundings more often than not for other Carnotauruses. If I am being attacked by a, a by a Paki, by anything, and I think the group of Pakis is too big, too risky, I just fall back in mod pool. Uh, this is valid when playing Carnotaurus against any playable but Carnotaurus, of course, but Carnotaurus, just because you have the strongest bite force. I mean, you are about to get the strongest bite force if you just uh, uh, moved from uh, uh, the beach area, from the western coast area, after 50% growth stage and came here to hunt uh, south, south of trash pit goats and uh, deers, a little bit north of trash pit. That's trash pit. This is trash pit. This is mood pool that you can use as a defensive position against others uh, playables, but other Carnotauruses. Same thing like uh, the dam is actually very good for Stegosaurus and uh, Tenontosaurus. It's a fantastic defensive position for both Tenos and uh, uh, both Tenos and Stegosaurus. And even Pakis because they can jump on another uh, behind another pillar and uh, then depending on the situation they can time good their headbutt. Even Pakis can actually uh, thrive around them. Not as uh, good as uh, Tenos or, or Stegos but uh, well, you get me. Every single playable has uh, different types of gameplay. And above all, you trust no one. No other players. Being of the same species doesn't mean anything. Seeing someone that is uh, playing with other types of playables around, with other players that are playing something else, it's a bad sign. It's a bad omen. Most often than not, they are on a war path to look for skirmishes. Just because they can, because they are super strong. Um, using synergies of each other, complementing each other weaknesses. Well, that, that's all for today. This was uh, me around mod pool, my type of gameplay around mod pool, waiting to reach 100%. It's uh, still work in progress, still work in progress. I will be running out of Pakis and Tenos meat soon enough. These uh, three dots nutrient will disappear for me in a few moments. And my great diet, my uh, perfect diet will be just great. It's all right, better than nothing. Well, that's all for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Consider subscribing my channel and uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.